I'm Mr. Frog. This is my show. I ate the bug. I ate the bug. This is the end. I love you. That, of course, was the iconic and long-running Mr. Frog show, which ran for 47 seasons and broke every record in television history, ultimately culminating in a national phenomenon now known as Frog Mania. But all of that changed last Friday when the beloved American icon put a TMZ reporter in his mouth. Though the reporter who was in Mr. Frog's mouth for seven agonizing minutes was unharmed, the outburst resulted in Mr. Frog being terminated from his own show. While nothing is official yet, rumors suggest the studio is looking to keep the show going without Mr. Frog's involvement and are even considering auditions to replace his character. Man, they can't just replace Mr. Frog like that. It's his show. You know, I've never seen the Mr. Frog show. Is it any good? I mean, you really only have to watch, like, season four through 17, pretty much. The rest you can just skip. Well, if you boys are so interested, why don't you go help him out? <laughs> you know what, Mr. Boss? You sound kind of crazy sometimes, but uh, I think I like that idea. Mm, I don't know. He seems pretty controversial. Yeah, unfairly. He needs all help now more than ever. Has anyone seen Glamp? I don't think he came into work today. Uh, no, uh, no I sorry, don't man. think so, no. All right, Rex. Next up, we have Jacob the Goblin from the Enchanted Forest. Hello, I'm Mr. Frog. Hey. Yes? Get out. Now. Next, we have Glep. This is the stupidest one so far. Is this some kind of joke? I don't even want to see you perform. Do that again. All right, I had to be sure. That seals the deal. Congratulations, you're the new Mr. Frog. The rest of you degenerates can go home. Oh. I missed my daughter's wedding for this. What, this guy? Are you sure? Yep, he's got that raw bad boy edge the real Mr. Frog had. We just have to tame it. Welcome aboard. Glep. You and I are gonna make a lot of money together. <gasps> hey there, we're the, uh... No, 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 it's fine, it's fine. I'm Charlie and this is Pim. Uh, we're here to help you get your show back. Yeah, helping people smile is what we do best. Oh, hello. Come in, hello. Wow, what do you do here all day? Hello, I just watch Jimmy Fallon clips on YouTube all day. Dude, this house is insane. There's like a thousand rooms in here. You have a gym, you got a theater, and you've even got a beautiful animal sanctuary. Yes, but if I don't get my job back on the Mr. Frog show, I'll lose it all. Hello. Well, first things first, have you thought about just apologizing for putting the TMZ reporter in your mouth? That was pretty bad. Hello, but I'm not sorry. Hmm. All right, that definitely makes it harder. Um, let's see. Um, can I pull your hair? Uh, no, no, please don't. No, 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 screw apologizing. All we have to do is rehabilitate his image. I guess we could try to make the world see the good side of Mr. Frog. How hard could that be? <coughs> Exterior, swamp, day. Bug is sitting on a rock. Gleb runs up to the bug. <laughs> And end scene. Great job, everyone. Glep, hilarious stuff back there, man. You killed. Uh, by the way, there's something else I wanted to talk to you about. Uh, Glep, it's the spitting. I know we hired you based on the spitting, but it's just that it's aggressive and toxic. I hate to say it, but it reminds people a bit too much of Mr. Frog. Do you understand? This new episode without Mr. Frog's involvement is projected to get 200 million viewers. That's more viewers than the MASH finale clip. You don't want to ruin your career like Mr. Frog in front of all those people, do you? Great, see you tomorrow morning for the big shoot. Interacting with fans is a great way for everyone to see who the real Mr. Frog is. Charlie, he doesn't look too good. Oh, can I get a selfie with you, Mr. Frog? Hey, 
wait, no, no, no. Hey, hey, hey. Stop, stop, stop. Come on. Let go of him, Mr. Frog. Let go bad of him. Bad bad Hello, he was insulting me. No, no, he wasn't. He really wasn't, Mr. Frog. I think he just wanted a photo, man. <laughs> All right, that didn't go as well as it could have. What should we do now, Charlie? What's up? Oh yeah, uh, you know, I had an uncle who killed an entire family in a gruesome drug driving accident, and he gave away one of those giant check things, and it was totally fine after that. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Charlie. Uh, but yeah, maybe that could work. Either way, the first thing we need to do is sober him up. Despite the recent controversy, we at the Meat Foundation deeply appreciate Mr. Frog's contribution. I can just tell you right now this one isn't going to work. Maybe maybe going cold turkey wasn't the best idea. Oh, uh, hello. Thank you for giving me this opportunity to... Alright, somehow no drugs was worse than drugs. Charlie, if we can't get him under control, I don't think we're going to be able to help him. Don't worry, Pim. I am way ahead of you. I gave him some of these already. Charlie, what did you give him? My uncle had some sleeping pills laying around to help him sleep at night after he rammed his car into a crowd of people. Your uncle seems to get into lots of car accidents. Yeah, he loves his cars. He loves his cars. Is it safe for him to be in that pool while he's <laughs> on that? Yeah, no one's ever done anything crazy on sleeping pills. All right, well, that's one problem solved. But... I don't even know what platform would let this guy on. Wait a minute. I think I have an idea. <laughs> Mr. Frog, thank you so much for being here. Thank you. Hello. It's good to be here. Hello. So so we've been friends for a long time, and we, which, is, which is why it's been so tough to see you go through all this. Thank you. It's, uh, it's been tough with everything that's, um, everything that's been going on with my life. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Yeah, why, why, do you, why don't you tell me about that a little bit? Like, like, what was the worst part about, like, the whole ordeal, like, working on your show? Uh, probably, probably working with all those filthy... Um, that was, uh, that was really bad. You know, I knew Mr. Frog had problems. I just never knew they went that deep. I mean, thankfully, I was the one who carried the show most of the time, but I did what had to be done. So, you know, I can't complain. All right, guys, you ready for rehearsal? Take your places. Let's get started. And action. <laughs> Gleb, what did I tell you? The audience is going to hate that. No more spitting. Let's try again. Go. Wait, 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 stop! That is way too aggressive and frog-esque! <laughs> Again, go! Great! People are gonna love this! It's like Mr. Frog, but without all the toxic crap! I truly saved the show! Um, so is my career back now? Mr. Frog... After what you said, you are not only blacklisted, you are you are completely deplatformed. Also, I really hate to be the one that has to tell you this, but I just read that the new Mr. Frog show airs tonight, and uh, they've replaced your character with someone else. Hello? What does that mean? Dude, it's over. I just, I just still can't believe he said- Oh, Pip, don't repeat it. My career is over? Maybe. Maybe I should do what I was supposed to do in the beginning. Hello. Ladies and gentlemen, get ready for the new and improved Mr. Frog Show! Why don't they like it? We spent $250 million on this. Oh, that's where Glep was. Cool. Hello. I know the world is very angry at me right now for my behavior, but I just wanted to say from the bottom of my heart, 
that I'm so... Frog! People don't want to hear from you anymore. You've shown how toxic you truly are. You're done. You've been replaced. And here's the contract to prove it. Um, was that was that man dying at fault, Charlie? I real I don't know, Pim. I don't know. That, of course, was the viral clip that sent Mr. Frog back into the stratosphere, garnering over two billion views across all platforms in just one week. Shortly after air, Mr. Frog was reportedly offered numerous lucrative deals, but opted instead to make a new show from his home and own 100% of it, arguably making Mr. Frog one of the richest and most powerful men on the planet. Hello. <laughs> Goblin Corner Plate.